Hello guys, today our topic is characteristics of good building stones. In this video lecture, we will discuss the characteristics of good building stones which are general structure that is how the good building stone would be look like and what are its weathering resisting effects, what is its appearance and what should be its heaviness, strength, hardness, toughness and seasoning and the ease of work these are all the characteristics of good building stones but before we start our today's topic you are requested to please subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to get more informative videos so let's start our today's topic these are the characteristics of good building stones which we are going to discuss in the upcoming slides first one is appearance the appearance of good stone should match with the appearance of the building lighter shades should be preferred as dark colors are less durable good building stone should be uniform in color it should be free from clay holes bands uh, or spots general structure it should not give dull appearance it should be homogeneous and close grained stratification should not be visible to naked eye it should easily split along the plane of the stratification known as plane of cleavage heaviness good building stone should be more compact it should be less porous and greater specific gravity for construction in water, heavier stones should be used, which are dams, weirs, and harbors, etc. For domes and roofs covering, lighter varieties should be used. Strength Strong stones should be used to withstand the forces. Igneous class are generally very stronger than sedimentary. Fine crystalline texture stones are stronger. Hardness should resist the abrasive forces caused by wear and friction in floors, pavement and bridges, etc. Toughness It is the measure of impact that a stone can withstand. Stones subjected to vibrations and moving loads should be tough. Stones used in roads should be tough and hard. Ease of working The ease with which the stone can be worked upon, that is cut, dressing, carved and molded is an important consideration. This property is opposed to strength, durability and hardness, porosity and absorption. It should be less porous as rainwater seeps into the pores, reacts with acidic gases and causing them to crumble. In colder regions, the water inside freezes and expands, causes disintegration. Seasoning. All freshly quarried stones contain moisture known as quarry sap, which makes them soft and easier to work upon. Dressing. Carving is easy after quarrying. Stones should be left to season under the shed with no walls to permit free circulation of air. It takes about 6 to 12 months for proper seasoning. Weathering. It is the extent to which the face of a stone resists the action of weather. Weathering phenomena can easily be observed in old buildings. Stones with good weathering properties should be used. That's all for today. In the end, you are again requested. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe it. And don't forget to press the bell icon to get more video updates.